Welcome back to the One API channel. I have the latest Xeon machine or a new accelerator. Am I getting 100% of the potential? Can I make my program run faster? Is there any way for me to exploit more parallelism? And how difficult is it to program all of this? Well, it's easier than you think. Let me tell you about One TBB, One API, threading building blocks. OneTBB is a natural and flexible way for C++ programmers to express parallelism on the CPU. I think this figure behind me tells the full story. The performance scaling with multiple threads not far from the theoretical limit that you can see here is very difficult to achieve. In previous videos, we've talked about the One API components. We mentioned the multi-device, multi-vendor open spec libraries. One of them is the OneTBB, the One API threading building blocks. OneTBB is targeted to work on CPU, but it can facilitate the work with other devices. OneTBB library provides interfaces, functions, and classes for thread parallelism. You can just use these ready templates for doing so. Here's a simple example. I have a loop and another internal nested loop to do something. The code is implicitly parallel because there are no dependencies between the iterations and the complex function has no side effects, meaning it is thread safe. Let's assume I'd like to optimize the external loop. All I have to do is to use the OneTBB parallel loop so I can use OneTBB parallel 4 to express this parallel algorithm and inside the parallel 4 we have a C++ Lambda function. So now, each of the iteration could be theoretically executed in a different thread in parallel to be scheduled and managed by the runtime. Parallel 4 is one example of generic parallel algorithms included in OneTBB, but there are many more. You can create flow graph, pipelines, queues, hash tables, and more. And this is why OneTBB was chosen to be the default threading model for Intel's implementation of data parallel C++, 1DPL, 1DAL, 1MKL, 1DNN, 1VPL, and more. So if you're using one of these libraries, you're already enjoying OneTBB, but you can also use it directly. If you navigate to OneAPI.com, you can find the full spec of OneAPI. Here is a OneTBB spec. You can find here all the explanations on the various interfaces, if you Google OneTBB, you can get to the GitHub page and find the open source implementation. Or you could jump to the Intel implementation of OneTBB to get the programming guide to get you started. And maybe the easiest way to get started is to run a code sample on the Intel dev cloud. I'm looking for the One API dev cloud, get started, and I'm interested in the base toolkit which has the one TBB inside. Just follow the instructions, it's very simple installation, and then connection using SSH. Just choose your preferred way to connect. I'm getting a terminal, navigate to the samples directory. I'll take a look at the TBB task SQL example. I'll leave you the link in a minute. This is a sample page, and I'll follow the instructions to build it and to run the sample. We are basically generating a new vector from a combination of two other vectors, and it is running on the CPU, and in parallel, on the GPU, we can compare the results. The TBB code is executed on the host. It is built on C++11, so it works seamlessly with data parallel C++ code, SQL, and many others, as you can see in the sample code. In addition, there are mechanisms to synchronize task offloading to accelerators. In this example, you can see how we offload a task to the GPU. So in this example, we have a CPU, the host, an accelerator, a GPU. The main function is running on the CPU. You can see that we are launching two tasks to run. TBB is managing the tasks asynchronously. We just have to wait for them to finish. The first task is running on the CPU, and you can see that this task is also using TBB parallel 4 for its execution. The second task is a SQL code running mostly on the CPU, and you can see that it is also using parallel 4. But inside that parallel 4, the kernel function is running on the GPU. 
So, you could see here OneTBB working in three levels. First, the flow graph of the full program. Second, the parallel loops inside the CPU. And the third, the handling of the offloading to the accelerator. So, OneTBB, one of the foundations of one API libraries and API and a standalone mechanism to parallelize and scale your code. There are lots of information and tutorials online and you can download for free this excellent book and read the relevant chapter. Subscribe, enjoy, thank you.